Welcome back on Maxwell TV. In the video of today, we are going to learn how to represent intersecting cells in a Venn diagram. In the last video, we have seen how to represent one set, a single set, within a Venn diagram. And we saw how to define a Venn diagram. What is a Venn diagram? So, if you didn't see, if you didn't watch the last video, please visit Maxwell TV channel to run that lesson before running this one because it's better to know how to define, it's better to know what is a Venn diagram, how to represent a single set before knowing how to represent two or more intersecting sets. Yes? Okay, by now, let's start by representing intersecting sets in a Venn diagram. For here, we have, we have this example. You are given the following set. You have set A. Set A is this one. You see, set A has element 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, and 19. This is a set of, obviously, is a set of prime numbers less than 20. Yes, and we have set B, um, which is a set of cardinal numbers from 1 up to 10. We have another set C. This C is a set of uh, um, set of uh, even numbers less than 50. Okay, we are asked to draw a Venn diagram to represent this set A, set B, and set set C. What does intersecting or intersection mean? The word Intersection means this is a region in a Venn diagram where two sets meet, where two sets have elements in common. Yes, you have to draw a Venn diagram by showing the common elements for two or three sets. Here we have both A, B, and C sets. First of all, you have to observe to see where there is common elements between set A and B, between set A and C, between B and C. Even you have to check whether there is a common or uh, there is many elements, one or many elements, uh, which are in common among all A, B, and C sets. You see, from a set A, we have a 2. Since we have a 2, and we have a 2 in set B. You see, it means that a and B are intersecting sets because they have a 2 in, in common. You see, 3 also have 5, 7, uh, only those. Between B and C, you see that you have 1 in common, 3 in common, 5, 7, and, and 9, they are a common element. It means that B and C also intersect. Yes. Um, <clears throat> you see that also three element three is in the both of three three sets. This means that all these three sets intersect. They are 
intersecting. When they are intersecting now, when you draw a Venn diagram, when you draw your circular patterns, you have to draw one through another one. Yes? Also, you see that 5 is common for all three sets. You see that 7 is is common for all of three three sets now let us draw venn diagram for room for this one this is a solution okay you have to draw this is the set edge before inserting the element within a set A, you have to draw other sets B and E and C before intersecting one, one another. This is set, set B. You draw another set here, which is a set of set of C. Yes, this set. Are intersecting because A and C they are intersecting within this one where A and B intersect here this one both intersect here where set B and C are intersecting within this within this space uh, A and C are intersecting here they are intersecting here it means you will insert appropriately the intersection of A and B intersection of A and C even intersection of B and E and C now <coughs> you have to see we have seen that there is there is a common element between a and b which is here we have we have two we have a two also here but we don't have a two in c to mean two is intersection element of set a and b you come here in the venn diagram you see where a and b intersect you see that it is within this region but because two is not included in the set c you will not go beyond this limit you have a threat to here you see that three is in both three three sets yes one two three sets you come and put it in within the this region also you have seen that the five is in both of three sets also you come and in right for five here uh what about the seven seven also is within set H, set B, even set, set C. You see, you will write, you will write the se seven within this region intersecting both of the three, three sets. Okay, now, uh, what about Raven? Is Raven intersecting A and B? or 11 is an intersection element for set H and for set, set C because you have you have 11 here you have another 11 here to mean it is between H and C 
you come here in your Venn diagram to see where your set edge and set C intersect. 11 is not included in set B. To mean you will put it here in this B, this region. Now, what about 13? 13 is between set A and set, set C also. You will put it within this region. Also, what about 17? 17 and 19, they are only in set A. They are only in set A. Now, put 17 and 19 within set A. The region representing the element of set A only is this one. Now you put 17 here and 19 here. So now we are done with, with set A. Let's consider set, set B. For set B, 8, 9, and 10 are remaining. You have to see if 8 is also in set C. You see, we don't have uh, element 8 within set, set C. We have 8 as a particular element of set B. Now, you come in your Venn diagram to see where, um, where set B is. You write 8 in the region where set B, I mean set A and set C are not included. For 9, 9 is also in, in set C. You write 9 in the intersection of B and C. Also come find where the element 10 should be put accordingly. If it is a particular for set B, you put it in the region of, of 8. Yes? Now, 1 is remaining. Yes? You see that uh, uh, 2 is an intersection element for A and B. Now, 1 is remaining. You see that we have, we have, we have 1 in set B. Also, we have one in the set, set C. Now, it is intersection element of B and C. You come in your Venn diagram where B and C intersect. You put, you put one. Now, you see that there is no any element particular for only set In honorary set C, we don't have any element. Yes? Now, this is a Venn diagram for set A, set B, and set C. We are done with representing these elements within a Venn diagram. Please, if you find this one useful, please subscribe and share to your colleagues so that all of you can run you can get new knowledge new mathematical concepts please don't forget to subscribe in order to receive our new videos and notification ciao ciao